Chapter 1. He adored Atlanta. He idolized it all out of proportion. Uh, now, make that he romanticized it all out of proportion. To him, no matter what the season was, this was a town that existed in all colors and pulsated to the beat of outcast in the Black Crows. Ah, uh, no, let me start this over. Chapter 1. He was too romantic about Atlanta as he was about everything else. He thrived on the hustle bustle of the crowds and the traffic. To him, Atlanta meant beautiful women, <laughs> of course, and street smart guys who seemed to know all the angles. Ah, corny, too corny for a man of my taste. Let me uh, uh, try and make it make more profound. Chapter one, he adored Atlanta. To him, it was a metaphor for the decay of contemporary culture. The same lack of integrity to cause so many people to take the easy way out was rapidly turning the town of his dreams. Nah, it's going to be too preachy. I mean, face it. I want to sell some books here. Chapter one, he adored Atlanta. Although to him, it was a metaphor for the decay of contemporary culture. How hard it was to exist in a society desensitized by drugs, loud music, television, crime, garbage. Nah, too angry. I don't want to be that angry. Chapter one. He was as tough and romantic as the city he loved. Behind his black-rimmed glasses was the coiled sexual power of a jungle cat. I love this. Atlanta was his town, and it always would be.